Good afternoon, everybody. Hey. Oh. Hang on, I'm not talking one second. Let me try and fix that. Is he talking now? No? Hmm. Let me fix that. Okay, how's this working? He's still not talking. Weird. But I'd fix that. Oh well, we'll do it live. After everybody, I'm hey, got got a bit of a scary game that I heard about recently called Shadows for Begin Gods. It's a cool strategy game that it's in early access right now. Basically, playing evil god and trying to help bring him to reality and destroy the world. It's, I first heard about it on Rock Paper Shotgun a little while, a few weeks ago, when it, someone did a long article about the game and how, how, what it was, so. Definitely a cool game. A lot of art's done by various artists, all that, so. Played around earlier just to, like, get a hang and unlock basically the rest of the gods, because you have to start out with the first god if you want to do everything, so. Yeah, first gotta choose your god, of course. Very ones with different play styles, like, this is the basic god that you have to start off with, basically. Giant snake that'll eventually devour the world. But once you beat it, you can play as the other gods, because basically you got the hang of how the game works. This one I'm going to play as, aka Yastra, aka totally not the mad the king in yellow. Naturally, he has a book that makes people go crazy. It's Vienna, who's basically about giving many cool gifts and stuff, but then betraying them. Got Ophanum, which is basically you can fall from Psy, or if you want to go really nerdy, Mandela Catalog of Satan. Or it's like to give the light and enslaving him to the faith and having to kill the doubters. This is the god that's coming soon, although he's currently the available in the beta branch. Basically, he mammon. You have to fight him and him kind of through trade routes and eventually get it through. Leaping between the decadent rich and the greedy poor. And here it sort of explains how we have to do it here. Basically, you have to spread the laughing tumor on the world, har harming both us and them in turn. Muses drive people insane and make their ruler mad, or give them to care. Eventually, a hero binds it and can use it against us to hurt us. You gain power faster than other people, which increases how fast the, the health, health I mean, our skill, our abilities you can use, but only when people are reading it. And eventually when you get to 300%. When all the seals break, the asterisk pops up, we can, we can use it to tell him to strengthen his soul. But the heroes can use it and kill us with it. So again, home is good and bad in this case. Go with basic size world, basic difficulty, and all that stuff. You know, turn turn limit on, works and deep ones on, the alliance is on, which is basically a big thing but that the good people do at the end of the game to try and fight back against us, so. We're on the world. Let me just let's take a quick look around. First, here's our first guy, the Slopkin. He's basically the basic guy for most of the gods, although the plant one we saw doesn't have start out with him, but she instead just gets to choose two agents, so. This guy's got three worlds. He can be stronger in combat when he's holding the laughing tome. He can make settlements go mad by beating in them. Or we can basically give him revive, re revival. I'm gonna go with this one for now, but let's see what we got around here, so. I'm off an island the nation. There's there's a big old cotton over here. There's one of the four cords. It's a pretty tiny one though. Basically, you can command them and help them fight against people to spread disaster chaos around the world. The second one, by the way. Up here, okay. But 
definitely go around here and spread around, I'm guessing. Let's take into someone's. I'm pressing the number keys to look here. This shows like the nation's profile, which basically shows how agent visible are agents are because you have profile which represents how visible we are and menace which shows how, how evil we are which shows how much people want to attack us by the way i really forgot to mention this is a new background that lady pixel will commission that you know i think i mentioned her last time as well and i'm experimenting with the chat bot so let me know how it looks i can always change the font or whatever if it's if it doesn't look right international diplomacy which can help us see who's yeah just explain infiltration to us Show who's likes each other and who hates each other. It shows how well we've infiltrated locations, which gives us more options and shadow spread. It shows how aware people are of, that we're coming. It's chosen one, which we'll get to in a bit, can spread that. Modifiers, which lets us see how special modifiers and areas. It's like it's a bit of death there. Tiny bits, but that'll change. There's a deep wooden cult over here in King McGarron's. Basically, there's a thing you can do which mutates a fish life and eventually you can turn that into a deep wooden cult. And if it gets big enough, they can actually become a. take over the area and try for other places. And it's. a cool stuff going on. The main point is that we have, we have the holy site, which is basically. Which usually can be used to help protect against the shadow, but we can also pervert it, of course, as we do. Covenant of witches who can also get infiltrate to help spread the shadow. You know, we infiltrate it and then we can shadow it to help create more darkness. Shadow is basically some dark influence that makes people like apathetic or willing to help you out. Basically, like the two towers, how when how that one King Grime was hanging out with just looked like he had aged 50 years in a really bad way. That's basically what Shadow does to you from what I... Here's all the her various heroes wandering around doing stuff. You see all various important characters doing stuff like fighting Bantry, pursuing resupply, beating up deep ones. Trade routes is a thing that's also going to be... It's more important, I think, with, with Mammon, but... Yeah, let's see who our chosen one is. Here she is, and if several turns she's gonna gain full awareness and start to warn the world about us. Being chosen one, she's really good at commands. She's also a bit strong and as well. And she has like her or some prince, so nothing too special, I guess. That could be used to exploit her. In my test game, apparently the chosen one had a real hatred against certain houses because apparently they wound up in a vendetta. Basically, the game starts off doing some simulation of how the world's running before you actually get into it. And where's your hometown? Right here. So this area is going to be pretty hard to break into because she'll be trying to warn this guy first, probably, since he's in her home area. This area here is pretty big, though. Might be worth trying to get in here and dividing up in a civil war or something. It's got these little island nations here which you can convert. Yeah, I'm gonna try and start a civil war here sometime and we get one of these smaller areas. So again, here's our agent. He starts off with a laughing tone, which I can drop off in someone's city to drive them mad. King is right here. It'd probably be a good place to drop it off. Here you can see all the sort of things your character can do as the like infiltrating areas to get further areas, all that. Yeah, we're gonna start them off going there. What we're doing now, we also have. Let's just a bit. Yeah, this place is pretty tiny too. Don't think about the cause of bit of chaos up there for something, but I'll have to think about exactly how I'm gonna do that later on. Let's get our eight age. Hang on, I just wanna see. I wanna see somewhere. Where's the king in this area? 
Do the Duke. Which is, there you are. So our power is basically this to boost infiltration and it makes it a little easy, which means now we got the library infiltrated, which means we can do stuff in our like research arcane secrets there. Also makes it a little easier to let's just do some extra things as our cultists take the settlement over. At least become part of it. Again, we, we gain power faster, but only when people are reading the book, so you have to have it out in order for things to happen. That's what this guy's job is. First, let's get our agent. We have a few basic generic agents, several agents that can only show up once. If we get heroes 100% in shadow, we can recruit them as well, so let's see. Your friend can, you know, preach to rulers to injure personalities. Warlords can getting the orcs on our side. Wizard warlocks can do magic, which comes in like geomancy, death magic, and blood magic, but use it to get that sort of stuff can make people nervous at about us and start a little magical arms race. Is this part of the same kingdom? No, okay. Just look in there. could spread some ambition here just to try and cause some political instability. Basically, because if that happens, it reaches 300%, they'll have a big civil war, but, which could really split this big old piece up. Oh yeah, speaking of peace, what is what are relationships, right? Like, I with pretty much everyone except the hordes. Well, they do have some they aren't that crazy about. Just more neutral. Bar. Enzo. And this is Shang, so look at that. going on. The square agent, the courtier. This whole thing is that you can, can steal items and place them other places to cause people to just hate each other. And he's also capable of causing vendettas, which is basically he makes the entire house of characters turn against other the house. For him, I'll go with mobile connections, which makes him slightly better at security in any place. Oh, it's too strong that I meant to put him in. Whoops. Well, luckily, he can move and do an action each turn, so. That's just a little thing about what magic does. You guys can see a lot of things here take a long time because how. Oh. There's security here. You know, I just realized I might want to instead just give it to someone, have him take over. Treat these areas as well. Give some, get some a bit of experience, and also make it. Also, having infiltrated areas makes it easier to infiltrate these areas. This area is really tough because it's a capital. Ooh, and after he drops off the book, he can go to this coven and help introduce them to the darkness. Here we are. Now that we're here, we can we just place a tome out. If if we were really good at we could infiltrate the place, we could actually just do subtle thievery, which lets us take a tiny bit of gold and put the book in there, which will get, make the ruler start reading it. But no, we just gotta place a tome here. Here we go. Tome passes from hand to hand. Those able to read it sharing its peculiar and abnormal source their friends and families. It is oddly captivating, and for some reason the story tells are impossible to draw for your mind once you hear them. Will escape exists. Not in prayer, not in alcohol, not in sleep, not in wall of tomes that's nearby. See, and now this area has a modifier with a laughing tome where, where it'll cause people in here to slowly go mad, but as it does so, it'll gain menace, which will cause pe heroes to eventually come and try and bind it. So, well, that's going on. We're gonna just go down to these covens and start spreading our influence. 
He's fairly good at intrigue, which means he can get through this relatively quickly. Speaking of which, he actually got a level, so... He'll boost his intrigue up a bit more, now he can do it in 10 turns. Wait, this some apparently Duke lost someone close to him, so... He's mourning right now, so... Because that, now we have an event. On the bad memory, so we can either make him more longer, or if we could cause him to lose 10 sanity, but... We don't have the power and he wouldn't hurt him at all, so we're just gonna make him mourn for a long time. Skipping a few turns since there's not really much going on right now since we don't have the power or anything. Here we go, the chosen one's officially aware, so now sh and I'll try and check against me. It spreads rulers, we'll spread the heroes hang out in their villages, and they'll spread it further. And their motivation grows with world panic up here. Basically as if world panic grows higher, people get stronger and they can do new stuff. And if it gets really high, they can try and defeat us, or the Chosen One could just fulfill the prophecy and kill us off. Meanwhile, here's our victory where we have to do things like in Shadow Rulers, drive them insane, destroy settlements, or eventually form a Dark Empire, which is where we shadow capital and then we create the monarch to do- create the oh, well, empire. You see, we and then we turn that nation attack its neighbors and ask next our bastion of power. And this is a little thing that happens every 50 turns. Every 10 turns you spend doing something, you eventually get a an event. Usually it's negative, but this is actually a good one. That's Malchus who are doing some weird experiments. We can either do some stuff on them to raise location shadow or gain some money, or we could just not do anything. Let's see, how close are we? In Some shadow here probably be good. Now the seal's broken, so now we get more power. The downside is that the main ability of let's see what this game brings does get harder to use as it as the cost goes up. What well, seals break because the cost goes up, but we can do we'll do some stuff here. How about let's see? How about the savvy? Because if we get the Shadow high enough, we can eventually just desecrate it, which will. Hang on, let me. There we go. We're in a place of dark worship. It'll start continually generating shadow, and. In event, in heroes won't be able to use the consecrate action to turn it good again. <laughs> and also, this addition, addition also let us recruit the Baroness if we want. AKA, Vampires is just really good at fighting. But I'm more of an intrigue guy in this game. Honestly, think that's how it's meant to be played. Oh, there's some shadow up there. Not sure from what. But you do you. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything. I'm not sure what his deal was. There we go. We've infiltrated Coven of Witches. Now we can shadow starts bring some darkness here. Oh, also, our Elder Tomb automatically generates some darkness. That's also worth mentioning. Bring us out of summon agents. Alright, one thing I like to do is just mark the heroes, the chosen ones, so I know what they're doing next. Now she's going off to fight an orc upstart, which. It's basically a guy we have to kill if we want to help take over an orc tribe because he's basically like their sort of leader but then we need a warlord or someone to actually kill the guy and rally him to our side. Another guy's going off an orc upstart. Is right now? I'm kind of curious now. Right, let me check the hero view. Yeah, there's one up here who's doing... Ah, I see, he's doing some orcish raiding, so, you know, he's just running out, out and raiding villages and stealing their gold. This one's just resting and resupplying after doing some work. It might be good to get some orcs out here to try and take some of these areas. Hmm, we'll think about that. Again, more 
fighting up against the Orc Upstart. There it goes, Orc Upstart's dead. Duke's still mourning, and now we have a opportunity to mess with him now, so. He's he's a generous person, so he doesn't. Because he just, like, scold, which means he's less likely to. It's explain tags, basically, he'll, he'll do things that'll go against getting gold, like, he'll be less prone to taxing people. Here now we can choose we want to mess him a bit more, so. We're gonna say he was too weak to save his friends, so. Now he's gonna get more combat. Which, if I can get this off screen, there we go. So I'll be more willing to do options like mustering up defenses. He likes combat and just like gold. gold. National actions, I think, is the only thing the king can do. I thought it was the king. Let me check. Okay, so I guess nobles can do up those actions as well. There we go. She's officially going to start warning the world about us. Probably our capital, I'm guessing, because that's where it usually starts. Her home capital, at least. Let's start some spring a bit more. Influence around here, just letting all these witches know who the real no king is. Unfortunately, this one we just got a gain a bit of profile menace because we didn't have some stuff to buy stuff from a guy who would AK pay him off. Oh, and someone's finally acting. You're gonna bind it up and keep it from doing stuff to people. What is the menace in this location anyway? Only at 56. Kind of sucks. We can get a bit higher before. Yeah, see, it's, he's doing it because there's generated a lot of menace, and, and it's also in his homeland, so he has more willingness to do that sort of stuff. No, we've got more important stuff to do. Yeah, just curious, where's this guy's home? I'm right up there. So once this location gets a shadow, when people rest there, they start getting corrupted. I don't think there's so much you can really do there. Oh, the farming village is taking over now. Cool. What next? Uh, let's go over here, eventually spraying some stuff so maybe Hierophant can come in and help convince these rulers that they should be fighting other people. Now starts infiltrating this area. Yeah, I was just trying to think of what to say, exactly explain what its benefits are, like... You can use it. Getting more infiltration, as you can see, this place is a little less secure. In, in particular, influences how infiltration challenges work. This place has got some political instability going on. Again, who knows, maybe we can topple this place and cause a big civil war. Would that be nice? I can spare the health loss at this point. And there we go, now we're slightly more powerful and we get new power. I can make heroes dislike stuff which can make do which can influence what sort of tasks people do. Like this guy like like this guy's thing is is gonna mediate politics because it reduces political instability. It's fairly remarkable, but so if he likes cooperation, he's more likely to do it, but he's also more likely to do it if he does likes combat danger or discord. How about make this guy dislike cooperation? There we go. Now as you can see, he's a lot less likely to do immediate politics because he doesn't like people cooperating. Tell he also dislike. He's also prone to stopping the madness here. 
sucks for us, but what can we do at this point? Oh, okay, she started to the king here. Interesting. Oh, because that's not really your homeland. Not sure why you decided to go here first. Yeah, now the king's aware he's going to be a lot harder to take up. Let me find where I can... There we go. Yeah, definitely want to cause civil war again. Oh, yeah, I almost got another agent now. Let's see. That's too special. Who's coming up here? We can start in shadow. Try and go there. This is geomantic locus here, which is basically thing for skilled geomancers to use to do their fancier spells. Now for ancient, let's see. Basically, basically big orc guy who's probably his command armies and caused a bit of chaos down here. So if we want to get take over this clan, we got to kill the upstart first. Before we do that, there's a wandering ogre here, which we can recruit into our army, if, into our minions if we have if our guy go over there. We're gonna do that. Got the fortunately moved that shadow there, which is kind of sucks, but there still is a little bit there. Now, this cult of the shadow will start spreading shadow to nearby locations. I'm gonna have the shadow this coven and we'll have them lay low for a bit. here in the threats it can tell us who's likely to attack us you saw their motivation like this. let me find it oh never mind I guess not but, oops sorry clicked out the window I guess that messes with the music so still there he's still there He's gonna get the ogre on our side because he's beefy and mighty. And since he's pretty good in combat with 10 health, three ta four attack, three defense, and he costs three he commands, so we can get him. It does increase our menace quite a bit because of his special ability, but he'll be really good for taking on York Upstart. And you, you start enshadowing this cult so they join us. Oh, they basically just start spraying shadow around this area because. You can get quite a bit in this area, I bet. Yeah, unfortunately this guy's gonna start use a book against us, which will boost everyone's profile menace against us. Because we have don't have much power, but we he does lose the book. Here's the Here's the long uh, he's taking too long event. Uh, one turn will be fine. Here we are, got ourselves an ogre, so. Now it's time to go check out this upstart and show us who's boss. Oh, 
Well, there are some locations we can actually take for the works up here. Kind of takes a lot of commands to do that. So we're just going to go off to the orc upstart now. As soon as he's done with that, he's going to rest and resupply a bit because he's kind of high on his, his profile menace. They don't want anyone going after him. Oh yeah, apparently... Or you actually have, starts out with a, as part of family and the, one of the family members isn't happy about what we're doing. I'm gonna lift him up, but he's gonna intrigue, so he's gonna, I'm gonna give him that to make him less likely people to notice him. And he's gonna lay low for a bit, just to reduce his menace a bit. I'm not sure how high of menace you need for things to get dangerous, but... I'm rather not risk it. She's also gonna start one world again. That. Sneeze that. I think it was this one. By the way, let's show this sort of who's boss. So yeah, he takes. He's gonna run away, but we can get him next turn. Got him. Unfortunately, losing the upstart doesn't mean they get we're able to suppress we'll be able to suppress the orcs. But now we can take his banner and use it to lead, lead these folks. You know, show these orcs I'm all who's boss. I find that this fortress is the only connection here, but not this one. This thing they can start doing create wards against Shadow, which... Hey, so to help... Red, how, how's it going? Hope, hope your work is going well. And now people are starting to create wards, which basically prevent Shadow from coming through, but... 100% they can't can't get through at all, but it slowly decreases over time, so... Not too much of a danger right now. Lost... Oh, yes, it does. Okay, so. Yeah, it's definitely gonna have to wait for a bit afterward. More wards. One of those M's doesn't actually matter because it's way too far away. Again, okay, it's worth keeping an eye on. More wards. And there we go. Got another enshadowment. What's nice about Ab Coven's that you can actually lay low on them, and it's pretty good. Great, actually. 1.5 minutes and 2 profile per turn, so that's pretty good for this point on. Unfortunately, we do have a min minimum we can get. Hang on, let me lower that volume a little bit. And as soon as I go to lower it, it's the dramatic violin stop. Oh well. Yeah, it's just gonna lay low here and make lower his profile menace. Some queens die, and we've got two new powers. This makes someone attacking us lose sanity, but that's important. And we've got the sister power for one power where now we can make cures like something. Like, where was that guy who was messing around with the tome here? Let me see the heroes tag. I'm sure I'll find them. Or at least their home city. Because when you see a little thing pop up, that basically shows where their home is. Before you ask, we can't actually affect heroes, sadly. The chosen one, I mean. I don't see means for stuff, so we can't, like, say, make them like madness. your home right here okay yeah so i'm gonna make you like madness so you'll be less likely to deal with all the stuff going on around here there we 
go. And so now they have like a minus 20 to doing anything that involves madness, so... Have to make it more easy to spread madness over here. And also, of course, the shadow that I'm spreading is also going to help out with that. Go, Warlord's doing some more stuff. Me and the rest of the city's basically learned from the guy that there's some bad stuff going on in the world so that they should help out. And Queer should probably do something now. Let's see. Yeah, that's going to be way too much. I'm just, just going to give him... I'm going to give him this guy infamous because he's going to cause... Likely cause a lot of killing and when he dies that'll basically make everyone else lose... Lose their profile menace as well as drop world panic. Getting close to the point where people start checking out ancient ruins for cool stuff, but... I really seem to do that to be all honest. Now I'll just take over this fortress and show that we're the boss now. I think it's just about ready for him to start doing some more stuff, so let's see. Excuse me. I'm gonna, need, I'm gonna have you start get that coffin just so we can start some more shadow spread over here. Rewards. This guy got rid of the, some more of the shadow here. Not too much to be honest, but I was try hoping to get some of it spread a few other places, just tiny amounts. Wards. This queen knows what's up. No fights and bandits. I'm gonna enchant this place. It takes a long time because he's not- doesn't have the best lore, but... I don't have anyone else do anything right do it right now, so he's going to be the one to do it. And he's going to start organizing the horde just to get their army set, set up. This is game warning spell world panic now that's hit 10%. Son of the king knows what's up. Oh, he's a prince. Normally they only pop off when they're at the king's throne, but I don't know. I'm up starting. Okay, I think he's ready to go grab the tome. Yeah, this guy's trying to deal with the madness here. He's currently at. 71%. He's just going to take the tone, which unfortunately does do like 10 menace, which isn't great. We gotta subjugate this clan to get it to work for us. There we go, got the tone back. Uh, let's see, who do we want to spread it to? How about. this city here. I'm going to do a bit more organizing and almost getting close there. Now they're at the city, you're gonna go place the tome here and then 
head off one of the covens, probably. There we go. Now get over here and just lay low for a bit while the, the tome does its work. Uh, your profile's fine, so... We'll just lose a bit of progress, unfortunately. Okay, now you gotta lay low for a bit. You can't do dark worship, which really spreads out shadow, but that was a risk of getting people to attack the place and destroy it, unfortunately. I think we're ready to start causing some chaos here. Big target is this village here, because once you break a village or two, it'll start causing some hunger to places like this, and when it happens, people start dying and having to move away. All sorts of nasty stuff. Again, I will admit that I'm not really getting any victory points right now, but hopefully that'll change when we get kill some people off here. And there's a point of power. Let's... Okay, you're in this that place to some unrest. How about we? How about we make you like madness, just so you'll be a little less interested in trying to stop that tome. Because this isn't your homeland, so you'll probably be likely to do something if that were the case. There we go. That should get him up a little bit further. 100% is a real important mark, because that's when the ruler starts to lose sanity. When that happens, they just start and really mess themselves up and other people around them. Yeah, I still got some decent menace on you, so. Look around, see if there's anything I can do here quickly. It would be good to infiltrate that covenant so we can hopefully get it. Drop the. We'll desecrate it, but we'll see. Are there on the map? Let's see. Oh, wait, that one's all at the bottom of the map. I was looking a little closer, more up here ish. There's that one. <laughs> that one might be good because there are a few tiny places down here. We'll s think about it. Maybe just try and infiltrate a few more orchard or whatever just to get some cities. Under our control. We I mean, could just take this whole continent and eventually turn that into the Dark Empire, but we'll. Then we can go up here to cause some trouble here. If we do infiltrate these places, it will make the people call a little hard to notice. Basically, gains the medicine profile based off of how many human settlements are nearby that aren't in shadow or infiltrated. And if it gets 300%, it basically turns into a big sanctum for the deep ones. Then try and spread out and Turn the rest of the into their home. See, so yeah, maybe we could try and infiltrate a coven or two. There we go. We've got our enshadowment then. Again, the guy's upset that this guy's doing nasty stuff. But who cares? For a greater cause. So, get your wine and. There's also a deep wind cult down here. This guy's just going through to slice them all up. The oh, so. Go here and just get these farm folk joined into the cult. Okay, since we're in the raiding party, we can't really. Yeah, we can't really gain our experience, which we've gotten. 
Can't get some raiders on our team. Oh yeah, another another guilt in the family thing works, except this time it's good when we're this made our menace drops pretty sick. Raiders. Which one worth again? There we go. Now we got some new powers. Things like, just boost madness by 50%. Yeah, it's gonna do it there, but it's not quite 50%. Go here, infiltrate a bit, and maybe we can get some. Get to 50, 19, 100%. You don't need pro to file loss, so you're fine. Oh, yeah, let's do fix that sub. Can Yeah, I'll just take a turn. Just let Madness hit 100%. You know the king's aware, but. Oh, I just realized we can get another agent, but. There we go. Hit more Madness. Yeah, we're gonna need to work this place, but if we really wanna get some rulers fighting against each other. gonna create a hero fine here. His job is just go around preaching the bad news and getting people on our side. About up around Here, basically, this whole thing is trying to influence some rules' opinion. You know, making them obsessed with common ambition and messing up relationships. I'm not getting a bit of intrigue, so it's easier to actually get into these places. You know that madness is at 100%. The rulers starting to. Where's the sandy? Oh, okay, right there. There we go, now I can... Now I should be losing Sandy. Yep, 8 of 9, so once that hits, it's zero, he'll lose his mind and the fun begins. Yeah, I want to try and mess it around with this east side of the world since a lot of small divided nations. I was gonna try and see what this game brings, but unfortunately it's right rows of two power now, so it's a little bit harder to deal with. You know, Lightbringer? Stopping the darkness kinda sucks, don't you think? Oh wait, he can't actually be made to dislike Shadow. No oh, way, I mean why would he dislike Shadow? That's a good thing. Maybe just use wrong power. There we go. Ooh, wait, made him like shadow shit.
Yeah, I'm gonna mulligan. Maybe it's kind of petty, but who cares? Let's see, use power. Let's see if can... Wait, make, I do want to make him like Shadow. Whoops, so I accidentally screwed up there again. There we go. We've got our hair fun here. And I'm just trying to get a few infiltrations in. And maybe we can try and get. Get some line textures going. Down here is really want to do it because then we can spray sh and shout a madness down here where it'll really be good. You go up here and spread a bit of infiltration. Yeah, right here. Infiltrate this place so you can get people on our side. Here's sort of explaining how gold works. I can our heroes start getting funded by holding cities. We got another farming community on our side. If Duchess is dead. Okay, yeah, the place is gonna be tough to infiltrate because it's capital. Go down here and try and get some east areas. I still got a plan with the quarter because he does have a special ability to. Awesome. Right, friend world, so. Okay, I think it's time for Orchestrator to start going out and do some stuff. I'm gonna go down here and try and raid this place. Because raiding these villages will make it so people, these places can't get food, and that'll really make them starve, starve out. Subkin, where are you? Right here. And inflate holy site. Later we can desecrate it. Oh, we've got the army after us now. I just want to burn it down. Ah, uh, looks like he died. Yeah, that didn't work out well, but good news is that killing him damn Lord, our world panic a bit. But yeah, that was not that move didn't work out well. I think the problem is that they have this big thing right here, which is where all the soldiers came out. Oh, there's something up there. But let's try another thing. Yeah, I think I did go to my first playthrough because got a kind of messed up world where there's one big nation with a lot of people fighting against it. And we'll see. We'll see what we can do here still. The next thing is that you can steal items from people and get people disliking each other. I almost just want to get some dislike going on between him and his people so that will cause the political agitation. Let's see how much death is going on in the world. Maybe I can do something with that. Very little. Pretty pristine world, sadly.
sorry, just thinking a bit. of a thinking game and stuff I usually play but I want to try something different because you know I just big feeling I have to try to find out what would be good to play and get people interested in my channel and you know maybe I'll eventually find that one thing people really want to, want to see me play and you know that'd be pretty sick to find out Okay, good. We've got two powers, so we're gonna infiltrate here. I got a plan. I'm gonna create a warlock because he's good with lore. Start here because he has to be for the library. We'll give him death, which you know feeds off of death and disease and stuff. And he's gonna start a plague, which reduces prosperity and population, can spread between places, and can provide good distraction. So. We're gonna bring it back. Yeah, this is gonna be fun. Rewards or new world. Uh, our profile's fine, so we're just gonna lose some progress. And there we go. We've got someone going mad, and now he's obsessed with being a cruel bastard. Yep, now he's just. Yep, now he really loves to do anything that. any sort of actions that involve cruelty. You know, like really cracking down unrest by just. Hanging people out, which doesn't reduce unrest, but also causes death and lingering resentment, which makes people a bit grumpy. I also occasionally mess around with people's location a bit, like, you know, like, he's just running around telling people the world and to cause unrest or hiding all his gold there. So yeah, now we're starting to get into the fun stuff, finally. How's... How's the madness over here going? 86%. It's getting there. This guy's still not interested because in I made him like madness. He's, he's as the game puts it, unwisely open-minded. Okay, also, you can see he's a geomancer, so he can actually produce, make places more habitable. Now let's uh Got some fun in the shadow, which means she's less likely to do stuff to combat us. Yeah, you know, like Ward against Shadow. I thought you could see here what sort of stuff they do, but it's not. You also know he's mad. He's officially labeled Mad King, as opposed to just the King. Yeah, this is good. Eventually we can get a... Oh wait, it doesn't let us see the dark... Our r r agents until we actually have points. Done, you're done. Oh yeah, I definitely want Shadow here. Yeah, there we go. Now he's just interrupting his sky and whatever work he was doing and disrupting him, which just prevents him from doing anything for a couple turns. <laughs> so yeah, that's why you want to get rulers mad, because then they'll just screw around with all the other people. There we go. Got a plague going on. Oh. Wait, I thought there was a plague, but no, we just infiltrated the place. So now we can do what the Hierophant does. It's just preaching to the rulers about stuff, which we can make him hate cooperation or more ambition. Yes. What's King like? He's peaceful, generous, and brave, so... Now let's tell us how, how great violence is. Kings are pro... Unfortunately, so... Oh yeah, actually, no, no. Unfortunately, preaching requires lore, which this guy does not have. It kind of sucks, so we're gonna have to go around... Use a few more infiltrations to get that his level up. And then we can try and spread some... And preach the bad word.
I really want to infiltrate here because again we can desecrate it, which will prevent people from trying to make it good again and and we'll also cause it to start spreading shadow as well. And yeah, just kick the rats. It'll hurt a bit, but you can do it. There it goes. Now he's, he's actually done the bribe guard section, which will make it easier to infiltrate because he's basically paid his own guards to look the other way for any weird stuff going on. I also hope there's a lot of shadow spreading, which is shadowing the people here as well. Oh, she's recruiting her own little unit to cause some issue for us. I've got an item. This item basically lets us give it, place it somewhere else, you know, like imply an affair or something's going on to make them dislike each other. Oh. This is where the queen is, so. We're gonna just get a little bit of infiltration here. We'll go over here, just drop off this mirror and well, whatever this personal item is, just use the mirror, but and then once we're there we can get these people disliking each other a bit. And we start a plague. Sickness festering the sewers, and effectively those cast off by society, meaning safely buried in the city streets. Now carried by the cult. Rises in the citizens watching for the bodies decay, rotting away day by day. This is a new, an interesting event that basically there's multiple, oh, but one of them's facing a creator hates creation. He thinks humanity is a sin, which they want undone, but they're kept around because they can see the future. But one of them's is seeing the end of the world, so now we've got someone up here in Shin Bashin who we can go recruit. And basically, what we need to do is get a human soul, which can modify that pops up down here. And if we can get that, we can get a special army, which can really cause devastation. Unfortunately, there isn't much in the way of desert towns. That might be a little tough. I'm gonna head him down to the scene and lay low for a bit because now he's got quite a bit of menace from causing a pandemic. Can you lay low? And you just level up, so you're gonna learn how to be. This Queen of Holy State's gonna be lore, so. You're gonna do that. I actually clicked by Brave Guards game said no I can't do that yet. And we're gonna try and flip this place over. Oh, now she's talking to people trying to tell them that we need to build an alliance, which just sucks. Meanwhile, this king here has become super greedy now. Oh sweet. Someone's saying the courtier's actually totally fine, just ignore him. That helps. And this place is going mad as well, so this queen's gonna lose it soon as well. He's at four more turns, so. We can also do this to drive word of mouth and just, you know, tell people how. About the stories and all that. That's the way you could see what what stat each one does, but I don't remember. Awards. This prince is aware. Awards. Here we go. I've reached this covenant. The main reason this infiltrating this is just that way people stop focusing on the fish cult here, the old deep ones. I'll also give them a bit of power stuff to help make them grow faster, but which I will do, but I just want to mostly get people to look away for a bit. Once again, as it says, the 
profile menace mainly rises based on people can see them. It's basically based on who buys zones that aren't in shadow or infiltrated, so. Getting some shadow pure really help out. Anything wanna infiltrate or do I just wanna use um make you hear it dislike stuff they're good at? Hey, hey, what are you doing? I see they're trying to consecrate this place. You'll know, complete the move shadow but it has to be lower than 75%. I'm gonna make this guy start to like the concept of shadow, so. Actually, I think that was... Okay, it doesn't stop until... It doesn't stop the concern to action until after it is done. So unfortunately, I think that Covenant is going to be saved. But it does take a while, so it'll distract them a bit from doing other things. I mean, like binding the tome. Now here we can actually cause a sca our scandal. And cause a ruler or a hero, so it might not affect the ruler, but still worth a shot. And give you a couple more turns of just laying low, and then we can start spreading the plague to other places. Like here. I need a bit more here. I mean, there's a lot of political instability going on here. And this guy's trying to mediate politics. I think Arnaz please just become a real warmonger. Wait. And I can just try these places to matter to really make them easier to infiltrate later on. And that's one of the random things they can do, just freaking people up by ranting about the end of the world. You're gonna get some more so you can start preaching about why they should be ambitious and all that. How much do they need to the next level, actually? I'm curious. Quite a bit, so yeah, we'll try and do a bit of preaching now. Gospel of Envy, there we go. Wards, more people falling to the shadow over here. Nice, got 69% if we... Oh yeah, this guy's gonna consecrate unfortunately, so he's not gonna, we're not gonna be able to stop it in time, I think. We'll just get this holy state infiltrated. Ooh, we got wars. Where's this starting at? Let's see. Jang Hu and Ling Jing. These tiny nations, okay. Cool. I gotta use some more work going on. I mean, give my warlock something to do. What's the death looking like up here? Okay, one point. That's sixteen percent and let me take a quick look at death because again I really wanna find some good amount of death so I can make use of my death my warlock's abilities. Not too much here, but Okay, we're gonna try and help the plague long bit since it seemed to have gone down a bit. 
There we go. Now the queen starts to dislike each other. But now the king's come obsessed with combat now, so. He's actually gone lost it three times, so. Now it's just statistic, plutocratic, and bloodthirsty. Yeah, it's pretty clearly really gonna mess up this town quite a bit. Too late, Queen's lost it, so we should be fine here. You've got to recultivate this feet since someone here has been messing around and making it less nasty. There we go, now the laughing tone's gotten a bit stronger. Influences neighboring location, and when it's influencing a single character, it also affects your location. Yeah, again, I'm gonna let them find the tone, but not too much problem. Oh. You're not consecrating yet? I'm just in time. This guy thinks himself, maybe making the place look a little darker would be nice. Yeah, now he's just gonna go off to get a, himself a cell sword. And he's not less interested in consecrating this place for now. Soon we'll be able to turn that place into place of dark worship. Sweet. Queen's gun lost it twice, and now she's just looks gold and fighting. I just realized this guy might go consecrate a different site, but let's get our guy over here to corrupt it. You can spare the profile loss. My yeah, queen up here has died of old age. Not because there's a bit of a plague here. Not at all. Okay, I'll fin let him finish. I was thinking of moving him down here to hold the seeds here, but. Is this be a bit more important since it can get a few different places, but we'll do that. Ooh. Yeah, now people are falling to the shadow, people are gonna get affected by it, like that guy just dislikes it, so he's gonna do more to try and stop it. There we go, now we can desecrate the holy site and make it to worship darker gods than it originally served. Start producing show and people can and it won't let people's consecrate to save it. That's definitely gonna be good. You you're gonna lay low bit here. Yeah, I can lose a couple turns, that's fine. I got not a little preaching is actually like the rulers now. It's getting ambitious. Rules this cooperative, so. I'm gonna start providing some political agitation up here. Yeah, how come they all suddenly stopped? I thought there were like several people doing it, but now they're a lot less interested. How about we do a bit more?
I guess things she can do if someone gets too in shadow, she can go over and try and save them, but I mean it'll help with their shadowing, but not the fact they're kinda they're completely lost it. We got another work going on, sweet. Nice from like going after this guy, so I mean, we could get some death over here, maybe. This guy's trying to cure madness, but I don't think that'll help it in either case, because both cases, the people have already just lost at least tw twice. This leads is going to lose again in three turns. You lay low for a little bit, just get your madness below 20. Well, n now you're... They're not so close to 20, but Ooh, now she's ambitious. Sweet, more, more family members just like courtier. That's a whatever. More folks are falling to the shadow. This up kind of lay low bit and grab book and maybe bring it over here a bit, cause some trouble over here for the king. There you go, this guy's fixed savvy, but not be for enough. I'm managing to shout Dabby Lux. Most thing about Abby is now that it's corrupt, we can do some dark rituals here to get power. It does that menace though, which means people may try and destroy it. But yeah, I definitely gotta lay low now. You've kinda got a decent amount on ya. see big work going on actually. This sort of battle thing goes where each turn they attack the other side and the other side attacks and yeah commanders they can do more to help boost their side. So, so yeah it looks like that place is gonna fall soon and probably join this empire so It's gonna suck that she's gonna redeem the sovereign, which will temporarily make him better. But we've got a few places that can easily spread back into the city. I'm not too concerned, and so anything that draws her off is probably good for us. Getting warned, she's trying to redeem a guy. She's just bribed all her people again. Oh, this is where the tome was? I thought I'd put over here. That's weird. Let's get more and even more and yes. And we lay low here. Do we have to do it in the city? The city it is. Let's lay low once or twice. Return to just to get that menace down to like the 10 ish area. 
teens at least. You know that King's Felt City fell so nice. To and this is the thing that can happen where when settlements fall and it can establish ruins to rebuild the world, so Odds are when these people are gonna build it are gonna help build it, but we'll see. And how's the death looking up here? 44 in the city of Zhao, so. I think it's time to do some of this ne little necromancy. This thing will spread a shadow automatically to settlements and eventually until heroes kill it, so. Waltz well, around will cause some chaos and spread some shadow around here. Maybe if we get enough, we can get this covenant on our side. Okay, now I need to get that book back. Where did it go? I also. Ooh, there's also some devastation on there from their fighting. Ooh, let's stand here. Luckily, we can just turn to the Elder Tomb to get it back. Wards. There we go. Now they're getting into fighting since there's a war, so. Let's see, I killed Mediator. The mage is gone to hate the queendom. This guy's still trying to push back the darkness, which is all over this place. Now I can just get the tone back. Put it here just to get this place a little mad and hopefully get some chaos going. On, but every time you start spreading some kit trouble between these two, let's see what this duke is. And the gold violence. Now the ruler's deemed and there's no shadow here, but the world won't last forever. Well, it should be. Yeah, there goes constant decrease. Seeing some shadowmen over here thanks to the covenant infiltrated. Firstly, feel it's always good to infiltrate those places because constant darkness will really distract people and cause some problems for the folks here. Now we're causing insanity and stuff. Things are actually we're actually getting victory points now. Yeah, this is this is thing. This guy had a really big donation, so they're gonna so they're gonna name him their founder. And, and let's see, how in shadow was that guy? Let me find the messages again. And this guy's pretty in shadow, so this place is gonna start out pretty in shadow as well. You know, all this talking's got me bit thirsty. I gotta go get some water. I'll be right back. Don't go anywhere.
and we're back. Okay, so let's little check everything. You're here to drop off the tone, but how much do people want to attack right now? Now let me drop the tone and hang out here for a minute. Just lay low for a bit. I'm gonna try to do some infiltration here. Another place. There we go. Now this location is gonna start seeing a bit of madness around here. We're gonna see a bit of enchantment here. It slowly starts to spread out from this big continent over here. <laughs> and of course, having the tome out means people are gonna start reading it so we get more power. And you just lay low for a bit. A meteor, huh? How about... But you start to, like, uh... There you go. Now she'll most likely do stuff like help with politics and stuff. Here's the whole thing you get like refugees running around the map now because of all the fighting going on. I think there's gonna be like some more stuff going on later that's gonna be part of how that stuff works. Let me check the heroes tab to see what people are going to do. This guy's gonna attack my gay guy by casting a spell, but I think that's gonna not work because he's gonna he be done next turn. That's the big thing you do with geomancy, just like attack and people with your with magic. We've got a lot of political stuff. Wrong button meant to. Oh, I can't. Just. I thought last time I couldn't do that, but. No, I don't have the power to do it. Okay, well. There we go. I've let out a ghostly avatar of corruption, which will go around just in shadow places. Things better influence. the magic guy you're gonna go for lore and yeah lay low here for a bit now that you just quarter you cause a scandal between these two nations looks like they're finishing off this nation here Even with all the, the word here, it's slowly going away, so. Oh, it's gonna start spraying in here again. Just a tiny bit now, but it'll start coming in soon. Yeah, there we go. Someone's gone and start fighting the deep ones here just to clear them out. What's nice about Langlo here is that the supplicants also help him contribute to the madness. It's passive ability. There's another death from that area falling, so. The nation's officially gone from the map, but. We're probably gonna rebuild there, but. Luckily, we can do some stuff to hopefully get them on our side. I 
want this series of comparisons it's bigger than this one, although having this serial messed up is pretty nice as well. I can see here she's just going around and shadowing everything, helping spread the shadow a bit. Definitely good to help this area spread out further and get more of the continent. To go to that village and get that start preaching there. Main reason again is just to help the people ones hide a bit more. Okay, you still need to burn off a little more menace. Trying to infiltrate the farming community. Yeah, yeah, they're working to cure madness here, but again, that's pretty much too late because she's already just lost her mind at this point. Yeah, I want the king and the queens to dislike each other. someone which prevents them from doing work for a bit. Civil War, shoot. <laughs> That's good, but also bad because I kind of want to take this place from myself and build the Dark Empire here. You know, I've got heroes fighting each other, so these two killed each other, it looks like. This guy's got a lot of Manticore Coach trophies. Helps out with your might and command, but only one affects Braves, so these things just don't work at all. I'm surprised they can actually... Oh, there's literally one person living here. One population unit. And I want to see how much death there is around here. Hmm. 
Yeah, I don't think there's gonna be enough death here to really do good with the, that thing, so he's gonna... Hmm. Down here, I've got lots of what I can do here. You okay, know, cause a bit of desecration, maybe. You know, I'm gonna just taking some shot from another. But. To create another guy here and let's take a look at what the heroes of the world are doing what they're going to do rather is once they're doing something you can't really stop them reducing tensions right well it's nice but Don't you like that one guy from My Little Pony Season 2? Yeah, that's what I thought. How's the menace looking over here? 4%. And a little bit of menace over here. Not much because this is... Doesn't have too many connections, but... I'm making it work. He's just laying... Well, I'm partially reducing unrep his menace and partially because he's he can help and contribute to the madness here wards wards he's gonna get some knights some old ladies cost us some profile okay yeah she's casting some magic here to make it more ha habitable apparently not sure why I need that, because the place already looks pretty nice. This guy's gonna go attack some... Where are the dramatic loci? Okay, probably going up there, I'd say. Maybe. You help do a bit of infiltration up here, just to help. Help for when the shadow starts to spread over here. Again, he only needs four more turns, so by the time he gets over there, it's probably going to be too late. And this guy? Oh, okay, right here. Sweet. Remember that getting all these places in Shadow helps distract people, and distractions are really what we want to get. Gonna go to Sunrest. Uh, let's use like combat and Discord. A little too bad. I'm the Discord fan, part of the Discord fan club, so you're gonna have to learn to like it, buddy. Alright, so I'm also gonna do some consecration, so. You no, know, all hail Shadow. Yours right again, or whatever that song, however that song goes. Let's look what holy sites around here. Up here, one. One here, and there's the one up here. And getting these holy sites is good because then we can turn them against people and just have it start spewing at shadow. And there we go, now we've got a 
We got ourselves a gas running around causing more trouble for everyone. No one's can hide. Why not find that you can fight gas for some reason, including just poison ones somehow. Close 100%. more outposts going on here. Yeah, we're starting to get some shadow pierce, so this cult will probably start doing a bit better. I'm close to it. Not particularly. Oh no, she's gonna go by Natom since... Okay, she's actually right there. Infiltrating the docks I didn't tell you to do that. Yeah, we're gonna go help out this fish people of the city a bit. Let's give them a bit of our power and just make them a little more likely to help do some help out. Help them grow a bit faster. I'm just gonna cast here really help boost the madness there. Just yeah, I probably should have let a few turns go to be honest. Let's get to boost our power. Uh... Trying to infiltrate this place for now. Again, I'm really hoping that the gas helps spread some shout here, and eventually she can really cause some problems for everyone. I oh. dang, probably should have saved that power, but now she's trying to just reconcile. Let's see what happens. Ah, damn. Looks like they've forgiven each other. Let's see, yeah, looks like the problems are done. Well, she still likes him, but... Yeah, if I had one power, I could have made them hate each other even more, but... Oh well. Just lay low for a bit. Yeah, she's buying I can't do much about that. We died of what's totally old age and not the plague here. Watching well, my yeah, probably is because the plague immunity is going up, so when it happens, people basically become more resistant to the plague and eventually it starts fading out. But it still caused some trouble up here. do anything that might be annoying. I'm going for that deep one called that's fine. Okay, nothing too exciting you're you're all doing right now. I'm gonna lay low especially since you're gonna I think going to against Menace in a bit. Oh, 
I already, I thought it's going to. Yeah, the main thing I want to do is just try and keep people from doing it and mess them up if they if be a problem. You know, like media and politics, whatever. I really just want to help cause people all get into big fights and everything. That in there. Yeah, I'm not. Yeah, you're not doing that, buddy. Yeah, be really open minded, worryingly so. There we go, that should get him less interested in trying to... Yeah, she's bound to tell him, so she's gonna mess around with it soon. Because I know if you get people really liking stuff, they can eventually cause problems if they want to. But maybe I'm thinking wrong. getting immediate on her side would be good because she's got some good items especially boots that make her wealthy just by walking around but again if you get someone's like 100% shower you can actually crop up them to join your side Getting shadow because it's a little too far up here. This thing would be a good way to cause some death up here if we could. We just need to spread across water a bit first, that's probably the thing. Here's a sort of explanation on them. If you nurture a cult, you can, you can curse human families, and eventually they can take over the place. Which, let's give this guy a bit of more intrigue. Make it a bit even easier for him to go into these places. Just lay low there. enough floor to do it in just one turn. Yeah, main reason I'm doing that is just because there's... The Meteor is apparently really upset that we're doing some bad stuff, so you actually lost some sandy there. Normally it's not too much of a problem, but... It is worth just noting. There we go, we got some madness going on here. And the queen's become really greedy. I'm hoping she gains a like for cruelty, though. Wards. King is priming the guards. Now you go hide here for a bit. Especially since the hero's gonna. I need to drop the book off somewhere else, and because the hero's gonna. 
use it against us soon, so. Where's the king of this place? A ruler, at least. Oh, there it is. Yeah, it's where the flag is. Okay. I might try and pl put the book there next. We do got a pre-fun spell, the next seal. So that's something to be... Nations, shadow, shadow. Okay. Shadow, our patient, everyone gets a little more noticeable. Let's see the Zonu. Madness theorem, maybe we'll, we'll consider it. Oh, the queen die here? Huh. Did that happened. Must have missed that. Anyway, we got a new. New persons. The good news is oh, there's just enough mana that she's going to lose it soon. This isn't the kind of game you can just really rush through because otherwise you'll grow up and get. Well, actually, I know what we could do. Just. I'm right here. We can go grab that and up somewhere else. It means they don't show me that kind of effect. Way to say, I want to see that type of effect again. Let's see, there should be a way. Other well, than key bindings. There we go. So we can check out people based on our chit crates and stuff. About that part as well. In their preferences. That'd be good for when we're trying to find people who want to like madness more so they'll stop bugging us. Ooh, sweet. Now she's obsessed with being cruel. Awesome. I might try and drop the book off in this city so we can drive this guy mad and start fighting people.
Hey, here's the grab the book. And drop off in the city of Shang. You're a pretty good menace wise, so let's see what we can do about causing some more chaos. far but I might move you here so you can create a shade because it'll be strong and hopefully get a bit of stuff up here which will really help that deep cult grow. How big is it anyway? Ooh, it's officially at 100% which means that people will start losing their mind and shadow pop start going. What was what it said right? In the tooltip that popped up? War. Aramon Pomasur. It's still a bit of a debate which what, what I'm gonna go for first. We've got hunger here apparently. It's not going I'm devastated somehow. You have to do this, buddy. Maybe it's because it's no longer part of that. The culture doesn't have the food there. Let's see, so. Yeah, this is the kingdom. So you'll place Tome here and then go into hiding. You. Here to help. I'm trying to get this area infiltrated up so we can get over there soon. Yeah, I just talked to this queen a bit about the lines and she. your lore because again we're gonna need that to start influencing rulers now you officially start laying low because at this point I'm worried people are gonna attack you Now she's obsessed with combat. This one up here's gotten hyper ambitious. Yeah, maybe want some of your territory back? What are you thinking about that, huh? here to help spread a bit more shadow up here. Finish up this area and hopefully get some more up here. Thank you. 
gonna infiltrate here. Make it a little bit easier for the shot to move up this way. Where's officially safe, so let's see. Infiltrate some blocks sometimes. So let's go do that. Got wards. More lines talks. Yeah, let's get them to fight. There we go. More wards. There we go. This is our one. This thing causes the laughing tome to teleport away, leaving behind a tome that continues to inflict madness while the tome itself spreads a new location. It does unfortunately cause five tire of them, so. And that's why we've got to be careful about using our mat powers now. You know, it's been a while, but I think I'm gonna should have done this a while ago, but I'm gonna have you go infiltrate the cult this coven here. I got 20% of worlds and shabbed, so that's a good C. We got ourselves a get another gas then. Someone dying of old age. And first, I think the orcs are just gonna have to stay still low for a while. I mean, your upstart can do what he wants, but we'll have to wait a bit. I'm debating whether to summon the monarch now or wait. I'm waiting a bit, especially since I want to get this pair when done, because I think this is one of the bigger areas. It's kind of disconnected from the mainland and be good for you. What are death good death areas we have out here? Cathedral here, huh? Words into the holy site. I start to like shadow. Let's see. So we need some more turns to get the docks, but. Yeah, I can spare the profile cost. I'll, def I'll definitely help out a bit. Things falling to the shadow. Good part about that is that I'm more trying to just go for the madness because once that gets Max out, he'll be driving mad and become a lot less effective at fighting us. You got more wars going on. This time she's going up against this guy. And now we'll start another thing here. Nope, oh, our max out power, so. Means two things. First off, we'll cast this to boost it up to the 100 level. And second off, we'll have to warp away. Now it's gone all the way over here, so now it can spread some mana to Duke here. As well as look nearby locations. Not sure how important it's gonna be getting those places mad, but it's still worth it. 
Russians definitely will be distracted trying to deal with it. Zoom, whatever that is. Let's see. Yeah, okay, down here. Place is well watered, but the queen's kind of lost it, so. I'm not sure how well that's going to go for you. The other. Oh, right, got the docks infiltrated. Yeah, now he's got the docks infiltrated. I'm gonna have him uh, go. How about. I went over here just trying to get this place infiltrated because it's gonna get shouted up pretty soon. Hey, the Queen's. This Queen's match just hit a cache of gold over here for some reason. Which we can take if we want. Thing. This guy's created work against Shadow, so this guy's gonna have some trouble here. I mean, it's gonna slowly go down over time, the ward, of course, but still. Yeah. The thing is, we can actually lay low in these areas, so we'll probably have the warrior run up there after infiltrating this holy site. Be fun to boost the profile. This guy's going to hate Shadow. Okay, stop. Can try to teach you to show these people some cool fish. Let me just get him. Oh yeah, that's the thing that can happen is. And you match attacks each other, like I mentioned, so. Yeah, he's gonna have to see Doctor after this. But next turn, you should be able to get the gas out. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Mind catch. Do some stuff to, uh, to the fish here. Bring to monstrous creatures, which certainly increases madness and shadow. Even better if we have a. have a crop that here, we can use it to start a deep one cult. You know, kind of like the one that's up here. Thing I forgot to mention is that there's this thing around here. Uh... Yeah, the primal fawn. Apparently, if you get control of it, you can drink its waters to temporarily boost up your stats, like this lady's done. Pretty was looking here, by the way. Let me see. You're getting pretty big. The profile's pretty big, too, so let me do something about that. There we go. Hopefully, we should be a little less likely to go to attack the deep ones. There's a thing I can do to help make them less noticeable. Let's see, which one is it? The I know there's one that costs. Yeah, I might have this guy go over there and do that. Actually, there's one that requires lore and one that requires intrigue, and I get which one is which. Then now spread out the shadow here. More people fall to the shadow. I really want the queen here. Now we can get the monarch. The guy here trying to drop the shadow. Nice try, buddy, but. 
It's not gonna work too long. Especially, you start to take a liking to all the darkness. Actually, click something, but again, okay, what's everyone doing here? Okay, about done with that, and you're gonna go run up into the hills and hide for a bit. Almost done that, and you're gonna go hide in the cup, and you just influenced. Our awareness is spreading. Dude, just gotta go talk to the orcs for a bit. Okay, now you lay low here. And once that's done, we'll head out and mess around with some stuff up here. I just think, yeah, there's an arcane fortress here from someone. This will protect them from any magical damage they. Our mage starts doing anything like geomancy. Still got too much menace, which is what I really want to get rid of. Yeah, this is what I wanted. This is the deep one called menace. down here and go hide. Get away from the thing. How much will five workers be? Ah, you can just ignore that ghost. Ooh, sweet, the king's becoming ambitious now. I'm thinking again, I'm still decided to go fight some other people around here. He I mean, doesn't like combat though, which is a bit of a shame. It's time for the book to go hang out somewhere else. The city of Shuhan. Okay, not bad. Bit close to that one tiny little one city province, so could cause some trouble there. Maybe get the Duke here, go lose it, which would be good. Oh, the alliance begins. First Nation already heard their warning, and others may join them soon. Where's the Alliance? See, that's your big last stand. He's been trying to protect the rest of the cities and striking out against, Lot against Lost Lands, so we're gonna have to do something else to stop them, especially since they're immune to shadow infiltration. There's the Alliance. Okay, right here. If you got your lines, but guess what? I got one too. Ooh, all right, I forgot about you. Let's have you lay low for a bit. Now, time to bring out the monarch. Now the night is fallen, she returns to claim her throne. Regal and solemn, she speaks rarely, but her words resonate with all the weird in a way which normal spoken words do not. Even her adversaries feel a compulsion to obey her command. Oh, there we go. on these is a bit odd like I'll go with this I guess so our big thing is just convert a nation to the dark empire any dukes with 
Special Shao can join us. Let's officially create the Dark Empire. It's gonna take a while because of all the commands and stuff, but I left Lay Low for a little bit because just because I don't want people instantly know catching us. It's going after us because there's some decent people around here. We are pretty in shadow though, so that might be useful. Good though. I'm just curious about his preferences for attacking stuff right now. It doesn't say about attacking the monarch, but that's fine. I'll have him like shadow for now. I'm fine with spreading it around stuff. Oh, uh oh. Looks like unrest is hit 300% here, so it's time for off their head. Now that Viva La Revolution. And now the Mad Queen's just been executed by the mob. Help. That sucks. And how much. At least there's enough madness that her hair will go mad as well. Also, the monarch can grab the gold over there. That'd be useful. You know, just toss some bribes to the guards in here and just get them to actually let us in. There we go. These folks here are gonna be catching some weird shit. That'll slowly drive them off the deep end. Hmm. What do we want to do anything over here? Excuse me. Now, you know, getting the orcs coming down here to fight these guys is more feels more important than ever now. I thought this place is immune to shadowing and infiltration. Now that now it's become the alliance, it's not. Again, I didn't really pay attention to probably 
shattering this area. Apparently still can't infiltrate places, so that's weird. Interesting, at least. spreader here, but I don't think we can do that, but I think you still can't do some these spread. Oop. War. Uh-oh. She's joined the alliance, sadly. I she wouldn't be really interested since she's mad, but yeah, that's gonna be a problem. Do. Sure. for here, but you come from. Oh, okay, right there. I really want to try and get some of these places in Shard Avid soon, just because I don't like them hanging around here. Just. That's interesting. I'm gonna go for that stone. Where was it? Right here? Yeah, I'm not one for buying, buying items, but that seems pretty useful. I'm hoping to try and get this place a bit more, more fishy. Go. 
vampires made basically our big military force, which can use darker states to put our shadow into the world. I got a guy disliking the dark monarch. Which guy is it, mage? What's his name? because I'm worried he might try and assassinate the monarch, which would not be good. I just want to see what sort of cat are there any caches here that might be useful because uh, no, no one's dropped any money it looks like recently. Okay, this guy, so he's probably gonna be prompt, but it's like comp that. Yeah, I just turn him into real hate. Real hater of combat. Okay, I guess it doesn't can't do that. Let me see if there's any danger. If danger actually affects that. See. Hmm. Is only checking locations or? Okay, rulers and units, so let's see. Okay, here's someone. Let's... Okay, yeah, so danger will make them less likely to fight, it looks like, so... Let me make this guy a bit of wuss. There we go. Yeah, that really pushed it down. No one wants to just maybe, you know, maybe drop this. Still sucks, but not nearly as much. I'm curious, is liking Discord... affect your willingness to want to drop people? I want to check that too. It's not, okay. Here, how about you were spreading some infl infiltration down here? Actually, better yet, infiltrate up there so that we can shall be more likely to spread in easier. All right, you've got to let you lay low for a bit, just it's gonna really help you. Burn off that huge profile menace you got from declaring yourself ruler. So looking at you go for... What do I want you doing today? Trade this to you, just get some more options spread. Okay. He's that long, huh? How about you just go here and infiltrate this there? I think that'll make it a bit easier. You 
quite sure. Yeah, okay, these places are more resistant to infiltration because the alliance. Okay. Okay, I want to try and get some holy sites. If I can get a holy site in, in your land that spreads shot, that'd be pretty sick. He's got an interest in gold now. Alright, okay, you infiltrate here just to get some more stuff going on. Okay, we've got a crusade going on. They're just going after this place because the ruler's in shadow. I mean, wait, you see, it doesn't seem that bad. I mean, Find the messages again. Okay, I mean it's right next to our place, so I guess that makes sense, but still. That place. Hey, we've got a new settlement under, under our empire. We say it, but it has 0% enshadowment. Lady's gone mad. And congratulations, new lady thought I was gonna be good, it's actually not good. I don't know how these is called looking. 100%, it's getting there. Let's get the tone moving again. Okay, right here. Good, right next to the capital. Which is good, because it looks like someone's dropped the madness a bit. Which one of you two did it? Was it you? Okay. Yeah, I guess someone's trying to move some shadow from someone here. I'm try, but ain't gonna work. I mean, this is why they're invading, because you see there's a gas here, and that's why they're trying to invade this place. thinking right now. I'll wait for now.
guy. Let's see, I'm gonna give some money to the monarch so she can buy some guards for herself. Okay, right. You can only have one person laying low at a time. You go hang out in the coven instead. Yeah, it's definitely... We'll say it's definitely isn't the kind of game I usually play on my channel, but... I actually wanted to try something different. It's Also, this is kind of an interesting game that popped up and I thought it'd be cool to try it out since it's not one many people see, so I thought it'd be good to show off to a few people on. I'm mostly just trying to bounce around trying to figure out what kind of game I really I really draw people in because as you know it's a bit of a diagram. I want a game that I enjoy but also that people are interested in because you know, I can find a Venn diagram in that sweet center then I can really I can really get people noticing my streams and wanting to watch them more. It's a bit tough just trying to find that right center area. Just you know, let's try this place. Just get this there. Get the lights as soon as. Oh, is that? I don't know. Cause that city to fall. Let me see. Oh, okay, I had such a bad feeling that I actually fell apart. Okay. Yeah, I guess it's very seen some serious devastation. Which means this guy could go over there and cause some trouble. Got some ambitious guys over here. Yeah, having people like this here will probably help cause some political agitation. Okay, well, it's time to start taking over some place, so let's go to Crusaden. Got a bit of corruption, so hopefully she'll be more likely to give us some extra stuff there. Again, that's pretty far away. Well, okay, you're part of the line, so I guess that makes sense. Okay. So it's that back here, apparently. Also sucks that the Alliance takes over places they, they, they clear out, so they'll eventually go, start growing in power, so... Then. 
Because I can't drop this money off. Let's see if I can get it. Ah, oh, it's too far away. Okay. Right, so then you're causing looking to check this area. It's pretty pretty big, so we should hopefully take over the city and just a bit more chaos up there. This place is fully in shadow, we can just get to immediately just willingly join us by just telling it to welcome defeat. Yeah, I can really just get places that are owed to us just to say, yeah, sure, we'll join you. Ah, she's actually buying the damn tome, shoot. Throw your arms and wait for the end. We've got one more sea left before Yaster officially pops out. We can start using the tome to try and stop it. Let's try and end the world. You go here and lay a little bit as we wait for this war to finish up. The Alliance is going to take this place over, it looks like. They have, it looks like, yeah, it just did. Again, I really, really want to get some shadow going on down here just to help finish things up. Good news the warlock's all healed up, so you at least will be healthy enough to go off running around and dealing stuff. I might have to go help the deep one call that a bit more though. Partially because of menace and partially because it's getting kinda just needs more, more funding. What are we doing here? Uh, yeah, okay, I'll allow it. You can. Because I'm gonna, probably gonna lose this power or let's have this creep decrease. Let's, let's punish you for going helping trying to stop Yaster. We just like madness, huh? Not anymore. There you go. Now you, I'll get more interested in helping out us out a bit, don't you think? If I had an orc thing now, I could go down here and try and raid some of these lands here and mess around with these folks, but... Oh well. I 
I think Garmin's taking up that city's. We'll start Dark Crusade up here as well. I'm surprised that Covenant hasn't been shut up yet. Oh well. Again, that'd be helpful if some heroes pop by, because then they'll try and mess around with them sometimes. You don't need them. You can go, go grab the Tomin and drop it off. Uh, maybe in this main city. You can really drive everyone mad. That'll really help out. See you, Shang. Shang. Okay, over here. That's not good. The chills don't have anyone coming along with them. Doesn't look like it, so I could. How's someone getting away? Yeah, because they get at this place to join up. That's not going to be good at all. Ooh, but political unrest is getting high, so maybe we'll be able to cause the whole thing to fall apart. here. I'm going here just to help spread the shadow a bit more as the cult grows up. Ooh, actually it's so close. Here first, because that'll slowly provide experience show for time, which would be nice. Oh, I guess I can't drive out any infiltration here. Or just didn't get infiltrated in the first place. that gives experience over time, so that'll be nice. Get down here and go hide over here. And now you, now you lay low. You 
go get the book here. from the abyss. Once a point where it's dominant all life community, unaffect the human serenity, holding on to the life of the one blood. Night that life is brought to an end. This cult shook with little who was left of humanity, the aquatic forms now revealed to the world. Early lurching and gaining on land with incredible strength and endurance, they drove their human nature from their home, killing all who resisted. Native grounds is now deep once sank them, sprawling cityscape seemingly leading into and below the waves as the deep ones adapt the settlements to their amphibious lifestyle. Always seeing to expand their population by conferring nearby humans into their blasphemous biologies. All must return to the deeps. Smart madness. Yeah, there it is. Now we've gotten a little deep on army going around here. That's gonna. Their own little city down here, in fact. Just a second here. Start off 100% shotman, so that's pretty sweet. I'm gonna have the Dark Empire go up here and mess around with this place as well. Anyway, let's get everyone laying low for a bit. Yeah, there we go. Let things disrupted someone there. So it's pretty sweet. Now let's. There we go. I've got some war going on. Sweet. Unfortunately, my gas is getting so popular that now it's actually having trouble in shadowing things. That's okay, I'm gonna get another one up soon. There we go, got the guy really into ambition now. Hell yeah. That's always good because I don't want to usually be less cooperative with people. What's going on here? Alright, King Shang fighting the Alliance. Burn down their pet people and all that. Yeah, and see the population of Deep One Siege now provides the its victory points to us as well. Yeah, as long as leave us alone, we'll be fine. What are you doing, buddy? No, reducing unrest, that's fine. Like to cost some money. You know, the cathedral fell so I'm dying there. Man, this obsessed with combat. I'm gonna die. They never really say when, how it dies. Ah, plague. Okay, nice.
might have been a bit too late to use the cavern down there, but still. This caused the shadow over time, and that's always good. Is just clearing up over here. Let's get a monarch over here and just capture these last two areas up here. And this over here is dead. Look, your air is still pretty sh shadowed, so that's good. Okay, how's. There it goes. King's reach 100% shadow. That's good. Yeah, so much for being redeemed. Oh, wait. He, she's still doing the redeeming. Whoops. Guess he's not going to be 100% for that long, but... You know, they'll still be interested in that war once this is all going on. These armies do not pile up on here. Not that I mind, just curious. Okay, let's see. Can I get some death? Okay, yeah, I'll get some shaman over here. Now let's try and get him over there. Yeah, it does suck that the guys can be fixed, but again, all the shadows surrounding him, I can't just, won't be able to hold off for long. Right, you have the book. I'm gonna put you over. Yeah, right. How about the bit of lore now? Okay, let's just let you see the thing. I was just looking at those one with those block blocks were. Let these people know that the darkness is coming. Yeah, look around these little islands here, so they're kind of busy with the mainland right now, it looks like. Jeez, what's going on over here? Got some good command bonuses, it looks like. I'm not sure what's going on. Yeah, probably Lions just trying to attack this place. Let me. International relation diplomacy. Oh, right, that place that defected, maybe. I think so.
All oh, right, that's our place. This thing that our that our queen looks like this with the dark rope and over her head and all that. This is appropriately spooky. Yeah, what are those deep ones doing? go to yeah come just to lay low for a bit you good You're probably ready to go out to do some more stuff let's play two okay. Oh. Anyway, how's the plague looking over here, actually? I'm curious. I mean, it looks like it's fading out over here, it might probably because of how big the plague community is. Oh well. do with this guy now to be honest I don't just go here and try and spread some panic about the plague Got some work going on. Still can exactly just trying to. Okay. Find more civil war. I'm guessing. I'm guessing it. So I'm assuming, let me double check the thing, it usually says what happens. Yeah, war and inter international relationships. Sweet. Oh, I know we can go here to try and get straight this place and try and get the ruler on our side a bit more. You place atonement and run like hell. I think the quarter is going to die. Honestly, it's not too much of a problem because I was getting... I was trying to feel like I wasn't sure what I wanted to do with him at this point. I saw there's a lot of death over... Here, was it? Yeah, there. And you're gonna get death shadow to really cause some trouble over here with shadow. Hopefully, get some. We'll help on us and help a 
significant now that you've dropped a tome. You're gonna run. Orange Shadow meant good. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, Courtier's got to run. Yeah, but we're going to at least save the Doctor's deck. I'm not sure why he attacked us in the first place, to be honest. Probably kept a closer on this right now. I didn't see my course on here at all, so don't know, again, don't know why that happened. But yeah, you go up there and try and up that place. Right, I forgot about your monarch. Just lay low here and let's get some of the work go on. I want you to lay low just a little bit longer because again, I kind of worried about that guy going after us last time, but I'm not sure what that event does, just especially the little grief to feed them thing. But... I mean, you might be thinking it's suicide. No, it's not. I just I don't know what it means to be honest. The cities are good for hiding, apparently. That's good to know. Are there are better places to lay low in terms of losing profile menace. I just keep an eye on this place because I want to make sure the tome doesn't get taken. Especially important given that, you know, in this place if the... It's getting close to the point where they can use the tome to stop me for good. much of promise. It's already under my control, so nope. Too bad for them. Are you going after Okay, I'll allow it. Try and take this place over to help reduce security here. Yeah, we're just people go even we're here is just basically inevitable. Alright, the monarchs here, uh well this is embarrassing. I'll just go hang out in the city then. We've got the hordes distraction good. some enchantment here at least to distract these guys a bit. They'll have you hide over here. Good thing 
he's that since he's stealthy. He doesn't have much profile at the very least. Which help keep him good and safe from all the trouble going on he's causing. Yeah, Soak's going mad is pretty much inevitable. Here's I slowly cause and shot him because that rock I have, remember. Alright, since there. Alright, since he's totally in shadow, he's actually sending me might help me. Because of where she actually attacked our kind of when I shied. Don't get really calm danger. Let's check the heroes again. Anyone going to go bind a tomer? Tomer? Not that I see. Wait, oh, yeah, apparently Brandon this place just turned to deep one himself, so now he's just causing some... He's trying to help spread the one over here. Cool. That would be nice if we get a second colony over here. Yeah, I was wondering where that 5 fight went to. I thought it was going to be an army or something, but... No, no it's the Baron who decided to just leave his home, become fish, and... Help spread the madness. Wait, we're definitely ready to do some infiltration. What can I send you out to do? Fall behind and just get this place in shadow for when it pops. No one's doing anything about the madness here, that's good. off this covenant and when it becomes ours we can take it for ourselves all right once we take over a covenant we can chat we can just des desecrate it Talking about making an alliance, but probably worried about the shadow that's popping up here. Okay, 
Okay, that's interesting. Profiles measure in like actual tiles, not the connections. That's good to know. Who knows? I might create a second gas if I can. That I can see. is building up their stuff here well you know she's still trying to talk to this guy about joining the alliance come on gas work your magic better off over here trying to get this thing on our side. Yeah, that's for the best. She needs to be shouted a bit more. I'm a sorry, she kind of deserves for dirt killing our guy off. Boys, now it's time for now it's time for your next job. Hey, you've got more lines going to people going to work in C lines. Sweet. Anything distracting from us is good for good news. This automatic desk crate looks like. You just go hang out in this abyssal city somehow. I'm not sure how he hangs out down there. Is he actually like among the fish people or whatever? I don't know. Pace and power. You just go around and let these folks know if their days are numbered. some madness here. Wait, what about here? How's madness here? Oh yeah, time to... Yeah, let's... Which one is it? It's this one. Yeah, there we go. Now the queen will start to lose her mind.
Got some people paint. Can help out these onies. Let's see. Yeah, you're, you're part of this folks, so cool. Now infiltrate the palace. We know I'm trying to go after and kill you again. Letting him do my catch again when it's everyone going on here, but I don't know. I want to keep, keep at least five power in hand in case I need to have the book run off. But What's going on down here? I see your deep one cult there. Okay. Not sure if he's the one causing it, but. Man, look at this melee. I wonder our mother's down here fighting. I just wanted to let you guys know you're all going to die soon. You'll all be worshipping a Dark Emperor. Dark Empress and then eventually just worshipping madness itself. Talk to you later. Nice, got an epi up there we can mess with. down here and lay low. This is a really good place to lay low because it's mostly infiltrated and has a lot of shadow as well, so that's definitely good. You go down here and partially hide out and partially just to get the rest of the area shadowed. Remember, I'm not sure if this is a warning spot on this, but yeah, it means we're on the settlements in the Dark Empire will become more shadowed very quickly. And she's really talking about making that build that alliance. Not good. There, just hang, hang out for a bit and maybe try and declare war on these folks. We have to. Oh, never mind, she's gonna go fight the orc upstart. Cool. Your armies, by the way, are they down here? Yeah, they are for some reason. What's Jeremy is saying? This is kind of weird, but I'm not exactly sure how to. Fighting for who, right? At this point. Yeah, this is weird that there's only two sides and orcs helping one side. I don't know. Yeah, definitely need to lay low. I lay low just a bit while this guy finishes up his work. Do some campaigning with all of your underwater folk and all that. You know, all the good stuff. And work up starts dead, so she's probably gonna go try and. Oh, there's a second work up start, right? We can get hens rain in this place, sweet.
Let's get you liking Shadow, because I'm worried that you're going to be doing some stuff to pose us just hanging around a little too close to where I want to just mess around with. There's like no security here. You can do some infiltration here while you're waiting. Wards. Oh, you want Bastion? Let's see where that is. I do admit the scheme does have some MUI improvements it could use. Like, Okay, one ward down here. Let me double check them. Oh, you won, not you, Han. Where is that? Oh, up here, okay. Yeah, it's really just been sitting up here not knowing that the whole world's going to hell in a handbasket. <laughs> it's like, oh, I wonder why the, I wonder where all this fighting's going on for. It would be better for him to just go hang out here in a quarter, try and do some influence up here. Yeah, you just wait a turn. When this town fell to plague, I'm guessing, or famine? Ah, plague, okay. Love for a bit. You go tell the ruler about how great it is to beat up people. this jerk will fight. Oh wow, they came all the way over here to try and fight us? Good idea, bud. I'm gonna try and help out. Um, ooh. ooh, some trying to bind Tom? Not so fast. It's right down here in the middle of this big old mess. Probably gonna have to move it again soon. At least it's right nearby, so there's already a bit of madness here. From its residual effects. War. Well, she was, but not anymore. Probably gonna go talk to this guy about maybe building alliance. And yeah, I'll start spraying some influence here. Hopefully, you get some happy turns. So maybe we can start spraying some more dark influence.
Darkness, shadow, shadow. Yeah, you can help all your our allies. I sure think they are trying to fight against us. Jeez, where'd our army go? Our army had a whole bunch of them over there, but did just go missing or something? Hey, where'd you guys go? Seriously. I swear, I could have sworn that we were. I mean, this had people here, but they just vanished after they killed those enemies. Okay, so I'm just gonna lay low here while you guys do your thing. And hopefully, our army will be coming back to help us. Huh? Huh? Ships and defenses or something. Raise an army. Okay, I'm gonna try and throw down a welcome defeat or two over there just to make them sweeten your army a bit. Well, hopefully, someone here raises an army. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, she tells guy how great having an army is. Especially when you use it to go attack people. Question now is where's the new seat of power? Down here, eh? Not bad news for you. Because our new leader is absolutely bananas. do with all this power we got a lot of it we'll just move around for now I would bounce around and spread its men this bit yeah right there
really with only three troops? That doesn't seem wise. Got this sword trying to do something. It doesn't really have much, but it could take over a few of these little villages. That'd be good. Yeah, I should have no idea where the army I had went. With three or four guys here, and then they all just vanished. Everyone's just focused on brutal crackdowns as opposed to actually raising an army. Which would really help out right now, but everyone's too busy just running around with thumbs up their butt. It's just hanging the populace. I'm going to need to help spread some shadow up here. Let's hang out here while we're waiting for... Get working. You lay low here while she runs off to go tell this guy about what's going on. You're slightly better at spreading shadow, and getting a whole bunch of it dumped on here would really help out. Who's this? That false shadow was it? Someone I can. Okay, just one of my rulers. Okay. Very disappointing, Dark Army. I thought you'd be better than this. You sure you wouldn't call that? That might help out. Just tear down the entire city. No wars down here. Yeah, I'm probably gonna go try and build lines with uh, what was it again? Oh, right here, apparently. Okay. Oh, right here. Okay, I see. It's getting a little dicey because I really misunderstood how war works. Hey, if this place falls, I can just convert this other nation to my Dark Empire. How about that?
Okay, you go over here and tell these people how good to speak wimp. I'm curious, does that actually affect your willingness to build an army? Uh, no, I gotta do a city, not you guys. Okay, no, it affects your willingness to do combat, but... You can try to propagate some people to go, come into the deep one sanctum. Especially one from this place. And again, I did not expect this to. That this would be how armies work. <laughs> well, at least I can have the monarch do some stuff to help. I'll bash him down. Attacks there. Let me see. Oh, there we go. Those orcs are doing some causing chaos over here. Good. I should get an army though to help cause some help fight back the orcs though. Spring some more of your influence over here with some infiltration. I'm guessing you're going to go help this army or something. There we go. I'll give you a bit of lore so that way you can help out with stuff like this. Another hundred percent. This book's probably welcome defeat. Matt Burns and our deep one friends start another cult up here. Great. Anything that distracts them is going to be good for us. If I can really get this, this city over here in shot, that'd be awesome. I don't even see their army. Oh, there it is.
a little bit after smacking her an army bet. Yeah, I feel like that's one of the few ways to actually attack an army, sort of, with an agent like that. Talking about the alliance again. Oh, it didn't know orcs could attack refugees. It didn't know refugees could actually make an okay attempt at fighting back. This isn't going to work out with all that of security. You go over here and... Wait a bit, well this guy... Ignores the whole fact that... Oh no you don't. Good, more fighting. So she's attacking this work upstart. Owns by Ninchum. Not anymore, they aren't. Okay, right in our lands. Might want to move that there because too much madness might cause some problems for us, actually. They're too mad to defend our lands, they can't help us out. This game shadowed. This kingdom's gonna fight the alliance. And this place up here's got a new orca shop to start. Cool. Okay, you're pretty much laid low, so let's see what sort of. thinking uh how much death is around here oh yeah I want to cause some chaos over here with the gas that's a lot of death Convince this guy to be Wes and you lay low for a bit. Now going to attack the upstart. In there he goes, he's dead. They're already at war with us. Whatever. Amount of death? No? Yeah. I think some of your folks are interested in actually raising an army. Thank you, city poor. At least someone's thinking about actually fighting back. Shadows. 
Oh, it's super cold here. Let me see. Okay, I suppose we can toss in a bit of power. And the final seal's broken, which means we are awake. The Aster's soul is now laid bare, taking up residence the Elder Tomb. Ageless and heroes like now interact with it. So we have to either get... We have to try and get up to 300 to win. If it hits zero, then he dies as he has many times before, so... We don't want that to happen. Yeah, that one at home, we can strengthen his soul or we can weaken it. We need a new agent, let's see. Where's the laughing tome anyway? I just want to make sure we know where it is since... Not right, it's in here. Stage, I'm gonna probably recruit. Where are you two? Damar and Takas, where are you two? Any other guy? But no. This guy might be more useful, especially with all the items he has on him. What's the cashier? What's here? Ah, some gold. Okay, I'll take that. I'm definitely going to keep my stuff around so I can warp the tome away if you need me when it gets a little too close. I'm not sure we can't pick up the tome, but we'll try. We can try. You grab the second cash. Too bad, so I'll party a bit more. Here you go, take the rest of that money. Now, let's see if we can go grab the Tomer. We're gonna have to wait to do that. at least. So maybe we'll be able to actually fight back against these guys. Yeah, you go up here, 
I'm trying to get that death over here. go over here and try and cause some trouble for here. Yeah, right at the end game, folks, so this is going to be kind of exciting because I'm just trying to figure out what I can do and really help bring up the end of here. Blasphemous first rules cause uh, just five percent. That's not going to be nearly enough. And more folks fall in the shadow, luckily, so. Hopefully, again, should get those last few points we need to win. I have you raid the periphery here just to try and hurt the food supply here. This is kind of looking like it's consuming just as much as it's getting. Ooh, sweet, new deep cult. Help him out here too. And because who knows if we could just make this thing pop into a deep end city, and that'll really just that'll just probably ruin our army. Suddenly they ask for help and all they get back is fish garbling. rapidly drawing to an end. The sun rises blood red, shining as a terrifying omen of what is to come. Heavens mourn for the imminent end of humanity and the dominions of the elder gods and letting before him he came into existence. Yeah, we're getting close. Yeah, oh, y'all gonna die. Or go, simply go mad. So I'll just lay low again here, whatever. Oh, I see, I think it's color based based on what it does, what's that you require? Like, this is purple, so it's all intrigue stuff. Okay. Well, good to know that now that the game's just about over. You start with little shadows here to really pump the shadow into the capital. Go in here, just tell them to stop building an army. What else do I want to do? Yeah, 
gonna try and gain control on this thing just for now. Oh, oh, I mean, it's about the end of the game, but hopefully we can get some stuff done with that. Point that most people are more interested in just hanging things unrest instead of actually trying to raise an army to fight against the people who are going on here. Uh. I'm gonna try and send the tome out to cause a little bit more chaos. so we can get some chaos caused. Alliance building. It might be good to cause some chaos down there, you know, just try and get this pe these people joined up in the shadow and all that but no get thing these guys joined up go here quickly and hide out here shells here just to really help spill over all this shadow here and maybe get and just accept defeat Give me some health so sure awareness and shadow more civil wars Just up here, so people don't immediately go after us. Let's rest control while we wait for because chaos down here. Uh oh. After a skin, let's Let see. Works causing trouble, good. about I don't know there's no cure but okay but we you know, want to go check out those ruins we haven't done any of that source from exploring lately we don't have any minutes so just leave them be I think she's gonna be able to catch us. Shoot. Wait, how about. Oh, it doesn't work? Damn. 
just get you just to select combat a bit. Yeah, there we go. Now she's calm down. I mean, they're really interested in get going after us. Oh wow, the queendom has a place only down there, or is that a different place to declare war on us? Don't go after us, lady. I'm just make you really, really just like fighting. Get you just like dangerous, that'll help get you up chasing after us. Yeah, there we go. Now she'll probably be less likely to go after us once she stops chasing us. You, how's maybe kind of fuel the fire? What's the unrest like? Not much at all. Jeez, okay. Damn, we get a lot of power now that the Aster's out. Yeah, just throwing some welcome defeats, hopefully get them to... Their armies just weaken up for a bit. Boost up our command a bit. It's okay, if, even if we do lose armies, these wells of shadows should hopefully get the you know here and we can start a second empire over here. Down here, lay low. Uh, you are still being hunted, I think. Up here, you can I'm sick, found treasure. Thirty five bucks. Cool. Let me go down here and just hide out for a bit. And just... Mm -hmm. It kind of might be good for you to heal up a bit. And you're about to raid periphery, which will really help the mm -hmm. image there. Just get past all this. We're in the shadow. Yeah, it should damage our ability to provide food. And I'll make infamous because as you have tons of profile. 
We'll just go hide in the water here. We'll sink them, whatever. More infiltration, just trying to get those final bits going. Hey, hello. She's still going after us? Jeez. Towards, towards, redemption. Alliance is going to crusade, unfortunately, against this weakened kingdom. I think it did help about a bit of advanced accelerated mutation. I think. Still going after me. War. Yeah, it's definitely a cool game. I know that the. F I may or may not stream this in the future because I'm not sure how many people like this sort of stuff on my channel, but. Again, mostly just testing water, see how people like this sort of stuff, and. Low here. Yes, I can. And the book is over here, so it's enough to spread more madness around the world. Ooh, the gas section can attack now. Fighting now. Oh, this one, okay, yeah, it's a pretty decent bit of shadow over here, definitely. Yeah, look at that guy. Yeah, it's episode I want to just kept that guy out of the way so we don't try and join the alliance. Yeah, where's that first star thing? Let me... Yeah, I just thought there was a... I don't even see any map anymore. Might have been killed off. Oh yeah, thanks. It's going pretty well, Zephyr. It's getting close to the end of the game, I think, but... Doing pretty well, I think. Not that way. Nah. Or you might be dead, but at this point we probably need some more books on actually being able to deal stuff, not just more political intrigue. Oop. Oh. 
Yeah, so long, buddy. You know, we just got some... Yeah, that great design doesn't care for you guys. Who do we want? Uh... I'll take Survivor, actually, yeah. This thing's like a big Geomancer, and... That means he can just mess around with the world's temperature and stuff, like... Make things colder so people freeze and can't live there anymore. Let's see, where are the Geomantic Locuses? from over here and try and let's put a devastation over at this area. Oh wait, do we have any arcane secrets you can get? Let's see. I'm just looking for the button again. Up, what he needs to upgrade to. You know, let's just got two places left, and then we can. Oh, three places. Sorry, that right, we've got that little coven up there. This place we're not going to recover from getting that killed, but I think we can do a little flip here and get these people to come back and join our side. Assuming, of course, our deep ones don't get them first. Yeah, you can actually go find the deep ones to help them get, boost it up. Just go fund those fish people of 50 or something. What's up, Vince Laid Low? I can shadow this full here, so let's get well shadow flown again. Too, so let's just maybe go over here and just help infl get some infiltration going over here because this is a capital, so it's really gonna be hard to infiltrate. Oh, oh actually, security's zero, so yeah, we can go over there. Then again, it's gonna get destroyed when it reaches 300%. That's the problem, though. Yeah. This guy's got to drop off all these big things, Manticore trophies for someone else. Oh, libraries and infiltrate, whoops. Let me fix that. Definitely late to be using this part, but hey, I need stuff.
Sprint there. Where's the clock going? Onto the funding not ache. Okay, it's accelerated maturation, so that's just probably they're empowering their funding and boosts them. Okay. Another thing I can do here. Now there's a big deep one caught in there. Adamant. Yeah, no. no, just boring rings here. Just curious if they had anything interesting. It's more half and shout, that's why it's saying that. Well, it's shocked that my dark army, dark empire is slowly getting killed, but it's gonna be a surprising comeback. for a bit just to boost your menace at the very least. And there we go, now we can I can force first the owner of this place to try and have to resist the urge to go turn to a fish person and go swimming around with the fishies. Oh. I will say it's definitely one of those games where eventually A lot of these turns are just ones you can quickly skip. Yeah, this rate's probably it for humanity. The shong is lapsed. Okay, let's 
start to really freak out these people down here. It's a little more icy instead of fiery. showing the unrest symbol. Here we go. And this nigh. It's over 95% so. It's now the sun's turning red. It's coming. It's bouncing around, but it's looking very likely that the world's gonna fall into chaos. No, here fonts are not ready. Okay. at the moment now. Okay, right there. You know, it just keeps sending around the world just driving people mad. Same for the city. Bang! Sounds like a clown. It's kind of like a clown horn to me. We got another deep one, cult. We'll work to try and get nurture and help it join our side. Anyways, you guys need more funding? I'd say yes. Yeah, Scania Tikkun Cult should push us over the edge.
people aren't getting about the war that was going on. turns left to do it so we get more people to join us and the guards are a bit distracted you can try and wait this is in line so I don't think this will work shoot Gas going on. I was about to go top of this place in a bit. to be thanks for hanging out guys it was cool to get to try out this game a bit and bring about the end of the world so see for the next time probably gonna do some stardew valley next time because i know folks have been wanting to see that game come back and and also let, i'll just leave you off with someone here and there's an also thing that apparently the music always resets whenever you click on the games let me see what i can toss your folks over to if anyone f see what folks are doing now. Play the we friend gets to play that game again and and a bit and. And I think I know he can send you over to. Let me just double check. Yeah, I'll, okay, I know he can send you. Let me just bring it up real quick and. Next time we probably do some more stuff. It was more Stardew Valley because I know that's a game lots of people like and I've been gotten pretty far in it. And, and I'm pretty close to the end of the. To the game at least with getting the major content and so anyway i'll see you next time around and hope we could do more farming and stuff see you then a lot less more madness causing